All right, so today we're going to go over Holman drill, or that's what we call it. I believe Calf learned it from Brian Holman, who is the Utah coach now. Anyway, it's a small-sided game where we get a lot of reps in, um, switching rapidly between four-on-threes and 3v2s. And so what you can expect from this video is I'm going to go over it on the whiteboard. I'll show you a practice clip, give you some instruction tips, and we'll watch another practice clip. This week it doesn't have a huge voiceover, but some good information. So hope you enjoy. Hi, I'm Bill Caffaretta, Tripping Springs Lacrosse Program Director and Varsity Head Coach. Thanks for tuning in. Please comment if you have any questions about the video or have suggestions for future content. Most importantly, be sure to like and subscribe. All right, so here's how we play Holman. Blacks up top, golds at the bottom. The way that we're going to start is with two black defenders in, all right? And so gold's going to carry up one guy from each line, and we're going to play a three on two. So... No matter how that goes, when the play is over, so goal, save, turnover, um, when that happens, okay, gold is going to go from offense to defense, and black is going to go from defense to offense. So we're going to bring in a black, two black guys, okay? And now you'll see we have a four on three for black here. As soon as that plays out, now, the only players that are going to stay on are the two black players who just came in. So all gold off, and the two black players that have been in for a while are going to come off. As soon as that happens, we are now going to start again with a three on two from the bottom, and it'll keep going into the same thing. So for the bottom, guys, remember, you play offense, you play defense, you come off. For the top guys, it goes offense, defense, offense off. Hopefully watching the video helps. Um, it's a little bit complicated to explain, but once you get going, it's really, really fun. Hey guys, I've been using Lacrosse Lab to make all these videos. It's so easy. If you want to save 10% off your first three months, go to lacrosselab.com slash drip. All right, so some instruction tips for Holman. We've got the goal in the crease, two teams, top with two lines, bottom with three lines. We play the 3v2 from the bottom and then the 4v3 from the top. The bottom team goes, as the players, they go offense, defense, off. Top goes offense, defense, offense, off. And you need six players and a goalie. You can only use one goalie. I guess you don't need a goalie per team. Um, the restraining box is out. And play for 10 to 15 minutes, but make sure you stop halfway through to switch sides so everyone has a chance for 4v3s and 3v2s. So with any small-sided game, um, particularly like one like this, we want to use a shot clock because otherwise we're basically just practicing man up. You can't go – no no real scenario besides man up where you have 30 seconds to play an odd man situation. So you can make it really fast, like – five seconds to make them really hurry, hurry. You can make it 15. You can kind of just have a clock in your head, whatever. Just don't let them play forever. Um, again, use the rules to encourage the skills you're working on um, or create adversity. Talked about that in a lot of videos. Um, another thing is there's no walking off after the drill and no one should be in front of the lines that they're supposed to be in front of, that being the restraining box and the end line. Um, and most importantly, most importantly, this is a competition. And even if it weren't, do not stop play to teach. Don't do it.
They learn by playing. They learn by doing. You can tell them when they sub off, but generally we want to get the reps in. We want to have fun, push the boundaries, all that kind of stuff. So keep score. Always keep score. So the one thing I forgot to add is whether using one goalie or switching, it's the goalie's responsibility to let the players who are waiting to come in and start the new play know that they're ready. It's very important for the goalie's safety. Otherwise, this is a pretty intense uh, competition from the end of our fall. It had a lot of significance in, in, our, in our general competition, um, and so I'm just going to let it roll. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 